In this video, we're going to write 2x squared plus 3x plus 3 over x squared plus 2 times 3x minus 1 as partial fractions. So the first thing to identify is that we have a quadratic term in the denominator that won't factorise. So the way to write this would be ax plus b, so we want a linear term to be over the x squared plus 2, and then we can have c over 3x minus 1. So we're going to multiply it by the denominators to get 2x squared plus 3x plus 3 is equivalent to uh, ax plus b times 3x minus 1 plus c lots of x squared plus 2. So the first thing I would do is substitute in x equals 1 third to knock out that bracket. So let x be equal to 1 third. So I've got to substitute that into the left-hand side, 2 lots of a third squared plus 3 lots of a third plus 3. And we get 38 ninths on the left-hand side. So that's knocked out that bracket. So we've got 1 third squared plus 2 is 19 ninths, so 19 ninths times C. So that means that C has got to be equal to 2. So now that we've got c, if we substitute in uh, x equals 0 next, that'll make my life a bit easier. I'm going to have 3 on the left-hand side. We're going to have 0 there times 0. So b times minus 1, so minus b. And then we're going to get c times 2. So uh, 2 times 2 is 4. OK, so that means that uh, b would have to be 1. Minus 1 plus 4 is 3. So we've got b. So let's choose another easy value to work with, x equals 1. So on the left-hand side, we're going to get 2 plus 3 plus 3, which is 8. On the right-hand side, we're going to have uh, a times 1 plus b. So that's just going to be uh, x plus 1. And, um, sorry, a plus 1. Apologies. a plus 1. And then we've got 3 times 1, take away 1, so that's times, times by 2, plus, I will get my words out, um, 1 squared plus 2 is 3. 3 lots of 2 is 6. So if I take 6 from both sides, divide through by 2, we're going to get 1 is equal to a plus 1. And so that means, in this case, that a will be equal to 0. OK, so 2x squared plus 3x plus 3 over x squared plus 2, 3x minus 1, is equivalent to 0 times x. So it's just the b, so 1 over x squared plus 2 plus 2 over 3x minus 1. OK, so that's how we can write this fraction in partial fractions.